Hello everybody and welcome to my video diary about the effects of laughter yoga on a human being. This human being being me in this case. Uh, so yeah, I've just uh, discovered laughing yoga and I have been feeling a lot of benefits about it and I thought it would be interesting and cool to share my uh, findings along the way uh, for anybody who might be interested in the future and is thinking about giving it a try and seeing how the long term effects are and how somebody experienced it over over the longer term as well. Uh, so I'm actually here in Ibiza, that's where I am. This is my, it's not my backyard but like three minutes walk. This is my baby. We've been walking around today because uh, the coronavirus quarantine has been lifted for babies and the likes and children so we've been uh, exploring and enjoying the freedom but yes back to uh, back to the effects of, uh, of laughing yoga um, so I've basically been doing it for three days every day for 15 minutes um, I found a group online that does it every morning at quarter to nine until nine o'clock and you come together, you do some exercises over Zoom and you laugh, so you move a little bit, so you, you sing a little bit uh, but it's mostly, mostly laughing and sometimes, uh, sometimes very loud, sometimes a little bit less but yeah, in general you're just yeah, having a good time and it's a really awesome way to wake up and what I've been feeling is really that throughout the day I, I feel feel more energy especially I, I have this thing that if I wake up in the morning it takes me a while to to get started I have this uh, fog in my brain a little bit I'm not thinking completely clear but yeah when I do this for 15 minutes I'm, I'm wide awake really and it's the equivalent or I would see even better effect than exercising for one hour taking a cold shower uh, all these things that I I normally do that I, I still do, but yeah, with this uh, with this practice, it just makes such a huge difference. It's really it's really amazing, and I, I feel more happy as well throughout the day. I feel more light. Uh, I have more initiative to to undertake things, and yeah, um, basically, I just feel I feel good. I feel happy. I feel more willing to share as well, together with my, my girlfriend. I have a lot more patience, also with the baby, uh, which is very cool. Um, cool things happen as well, such as I went to the supermarket and I was just uh, sitting and waiting for uh, an old lady to pass and I made eye contact with these two guys that were loading up their car with, uh, with groceries and we made eye contact and I was I was just sitting there and my experience not much different than normal but they just put up their thumb <laughs> like this and with this note of like hey how are you and like yeah I'm doing good man how are you and then they said we're gonna go do you want to be here and I said yeah sounds good and it, uh, it happened to be one of the uh, the spots closest to the supermarket. That was uh, that was a very cool experience. Uh, and I think the the laughing yoga contributed to this, uh, at least in some way. Um, something else that I've noticed is that after only three days already, I have more mental clarity in the sense that I I engage less in uh, addictive behavior such as using my mobile phone uh, too much today is a Sunday and I I just thought okay I'm not gonna I'm not gonna use my phone today I'm gonna turn it off uh, except for now recording this video and then I'm gonna call my mom I thought I used my phone today and I I've become aware of yeah like the yeah the addictive sense of it really and that it's it's kinda I think I used it to fill up uh, a void of when I was feeling overwhelmed or stressed or, or even bored and 
Now that I feel so happy and I'm, I'm more interested in things that are happening around me and just being outside uh, or interacting with my child or with my wife, um, I feel less the sense to do it and I see more the nonsense of it, uh, especially in this returning and addictive uh, behavior of it, just like the, yeah, just choosing it too much really. Uh, so that's, uh, that's pretty cool. Um, what else? I feel more creative as well. Um, and yeah, more productive in general. My head is very clear. Uh, I get through stuff. I'm a lot less worried. And something very cool that has happened is that for a longer time I've been aware of certain thought patterns that are not the most supportive for my own well being, even though they are my own thoughts. Um, but I, even though I was aware of it, I could never find a way to shut them off. I've been to, to therapy for six months, uh, which cleared a lot of things uh, about my family past, for sure. But I remember that after saying goodbye to my therapist uh, and moving here to Ibiza, actually, before I lived in Barcelona, I realized, oh shit, the voice is still there. What the fuck is this? Okay. And over time, it's, uh, it's not been something that really bothered me too much. I, I've been fairly happy. I live a very happy life. I'm thankful for everything that is happening in my, in my being and the progress that I'm making. And the last day, since I started, I felt that these thoughts, they, they came up less. As in, yeah, they just came up less. And, and even, uh, I noticed once that I was doing the dishes and I, I bumped a plate into, into another plate when I was hanging it up in the drying rack. And I realized that this urge came up of like telling myself, of like, hey, what, what the heck are you doing? Uh, kind of like punishing myself. And then another energy came in and it, it, it suppressed it, which was very interesting, very interesting. So the, that's very cool. Um, on the other hand, are there any negatives? I would say there's one that, yes, is something, there's actually two things. First thing is that I feel that I've become more impulsive. Uh, so I take action faster but sometimes it's not very well thought through um, so yeah I just I get more done but sometimes I think I need to put a little bit more break on how I do things uh, and think through okay is, it, is this the right decision or this one so the balance was a little bit shifted too much to just do it uh, which is good taking action but uh, in a couple instances I thought afterwards okay maybe maybe I should have thought it through a little bit better um, another another thing that I ran into is that I'm just gonna stand up and move the puppy a little bit because the schnook schnook is uh, yeah it's making some noise uh, another instance that uh, that I noticed is that I can be, after I do the yoga, I can be very high in my energy, very happy, very jumpy, very expressive, very creative. And I noticed that, for example, with my wife, that she, she didn't have the same energy as me. And there was a certain uh, uh, disbalance in this that we didn't completely understand each other. Anyway, this is uh, this was the first video about my experience after three days of doing laughter yoga for 15 minutes every day. Uh, I will make another video in about a week's time to report on my findings, how it has been after one week and three days. I will now attend to my baby because I think she wants to be with Papa on the arm. Uh, I hope all of you are good. I wish you an absolutely beautiful, lovely day, a lot of love, a big hug, and. May all beings be happy and free. Much love. Ciao, ciao.